I almost forgot to record again. Okay, I always well, forget to record the Civ Six games for some reason. Wow! <laughs> so you don't want me on your YouTube I remember channel. this time. No, I mean you're on there. You're on the YouTube channel. Uh, the rest of them are. I just have to end up like uploading the full vod from Twitch instead of just the recording. And it's just annoying because I have to edit off the beginning and end of it, and it's just like uh, so much extra work. I'm a lazy dude, and I'm just also very busy, <laughs> very busy dude. Bruce sad. I'm sorry, room. Hopefully it'll still be there the next day you work. You're going to be busier? No. <laughs> no. You want to try those ones, but they have a cherry flavor in it? Couldn't you just pick out the cherry flavor ones? Because you're not, like, deathly allergic to cherry flavoring, so... Probably just pick them out or whatever. Eat around them. Sure you'd be all right. Oh, they all look the same, at least on the package. That sucks. Do they do they look different, dude? What? The different warhead cube thingies, or whatever they're called. They all look exactly the same, all the flavors? Okay. Toxic dark blue color. You know what I like? That toxic waste candy. I like that stuff. I haven't tried it. I, uh... It's, it's just like warheads, but, you know, more sour basically it's not like that much different or whatever um but they're good i just i just like sour stuff really basically anything sour i'm i'm here for all right man it's been wow. like what six weeks since we've played three weeks i thought we were gonna play last week and then the pop-up was like i'm playing rim world and i was like oh okay well that's last Wait, week was a rim world oh. week bro but we didn't play the week before Siv, gotta keep that schedule Oh, um, <laughs> on another grievance for senior project, this guy's week... having me fill out an actual application and submit a cover letter. This should just be a class assignment, bro. Weren't you like warmongering or something? Mm -mm. I've never warmongered. I joined mm. a justified war with China. I can, but... yeah, and I can call a special session for that. That's fun. I have a governor waiting. Assignment? Oh god. For how long has that been there? It's not a very big pop up. Um it's neat orders. Okay. I remember I'm trying to keep control of Xion because China was trying to build nukes. I remember. Why is the red communist fist pulsing? Because uh the citizens there aren't very happy. And uh, they're threatening to rebel, basically. Um, they haven't rebelled yet, but they probably will soon. Uh, and there's not much I can do about it, sadly. <laughs> I wish there was, but yeah, there's really not much I can do. <laughs> it's, uh, it's rough right now. Oh, <clears throat> I... Uh... Units need orders. Uh, you can the World just Congress uh, failed, by the way. Thank you. Better thank me for that. No, oh, thanks, bro. Uh, uh, I only uh, voted one so down. Gilgamesh and Mansa Musa, on the other hand, do not like you, apparently. Yeah, no, I know. Wait. Why you got such a large build-up? They don't like me? They're literally allied with me. What do you mean a large build-up? Oh, they voted, they voted for the World Congress to... Oh, well, like... probably because they want someone else to deal with me. <laughs> Because <laughs> they're too scared to do it. Oh, I was asking why you had such a large buildup, but yeah, then you why... remembered I'm at war with China. Yo, yeah, well, no, why do you? Oh, that's that's my name, but that's your city. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah no, all my cities are named after. That is a little people. worrying though. You just got yeah. them all sitting there, <laughs> right on my border. Nothing huh? to worry about, dude. No, I'm literally Promised. at keeping the peace and Xion right now. Why do you keeping think the peace they're all there? After you dude? warmongered that city, this dude's literally trying to find a reason to start a war with me. I am not. If I wanted to, I would have voted yes in the World Congress. Would have been the easiest. You didn't way vote there. yes on the World Congress because we had an agreement that you wouldn't. I don't recall. It's been too long. <laughs> what was the agreement? Of? Uh. The agreement was I voted no on yours, so you're voting no on mine. That was the agreement. <laughs> I need more he pretty much wants to suck all the sour stuff off the toxic waste and warheads and throw away the sweet parts. 
I don't like sugar that much. Like S U C K or like S U C C. S U C C. You gotta suck it, bro. Um, get that sour shit off, and then just spit away the rest. Like, remind me. Uh, speaking of the suck, uh, I have a <laughs> work suck. story. To yeah. that's this sounds really weird. I have a work story <laughs> to tell you, not involving sucking in that manner, but be sure it doesn't involve uh, the suck. I I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Pedro has finished a world wonder congrats Pedro uh, Noodle would like to remind you you're not allowed to destroy the capital if you decide to start a pointless war uh, uh, yeah capital is the last thing to be destroyed um, was that our agreement no that no. wasn't our agreement it's just our the, agreement the, was the capital's named after her so she doesn't want it no I know we did have a war agreement though if we were going the warmongering mount, um, war warmongering way, we had to fight each other last. Yeah, all the yeah, other capitals had to fall. That's first. true. We did have that agreement too. Um, hmm. <laughs> Noodle says the capital is not allowed to get destroyed at all. Sadly, if he <laughs> does decide to be a warmonger, he technically does have to take the capital. He doesn't have to destroy it. He just has to take control of it. Um, and, you know, murder half of the citizens. That's all. Fine. Um, hmm. Yeah, can you see? Get turn. Um. Nice. Unit needs orders. Suzerain status lost. Imagine that. I wonder who took my suzerain status again. I don't know, man. Yeah, I'm sure you don't. Um. I have too many units. <laughs> Noodles crying. Uh, step. What step city step. did I have? I had Xion for a while, didn't I? No, you never had Xion. Which one did I have that I gave up? Right near where I have Optijek, there was one. I did I, I just destroy the name it, of it? I guess. But yeah, you destroyed it. Welcome rainfall. Oh, the aid request is uh is finished. I won gold! Hell yeah. Cool. Um, rainfall. Okay. Yep, yep. Can't do much about that either. All right. Um, what the hell do I want to build? Field mm. cannons are like a uh, siege unit, and then machine guns are modern. You're asking the range. wrong guy. I <laughs> like I could look it up. I'm just too late. I remember like nothing about this shit, my guy. Um, wait. Oh, I have mechanized infantry, and then I guess... How the fuck do I still have a musket? What? You still have a musketman? Is that what you're saying? There's a new arcade at the mall me and Optijack played mini golf at. Hey, no shit. Watch to start out, stop out there one of these days. Uh, you... Just skip your turn for now. Next turn. Oh, you need to get grounded. I was playing a little bit of it because David's going to buy it. Or David did buy it. Yes, I do really want to get it grounded, to be it's honest. So, like, it it's looks so really, really refreshing good. because it's like one of the very few fully polished games I've played in a very long nice. time. Very nice. Where there's like 
it runs smooth it's the sound design is great gameplay is fantastic so far That's i remember whenever it uh before it came out i guess technically um they they were showing off some stuff and like it did look really really good but but yeah I never, I never picked it up. Lost my suzerain status, huh? That sucks, bro. Um, oh no. You're not gonna fucking get me. Hey. Um. You. Uh, where are you? There you are. Kind of. Turn. I have two cool. Skip turn. Oh no, that's me. You. Oh, look at all that uranium. I wonder what you're doing with that. Stopping China from building nukes. I literally told you this already. That's why I can't just give the city back huh. to them. Because <laughs> they're fucking. They were literally in the mil middle of building nukes. Oh, Rue said, "Time for your original grievance." You guys remember how my mom's half sister found me on my 23 and Me. Uh, was able to re reconnect with her dad. Yeah. Okay. I got you. Why? How is this turning into a bad thing? <laughs> so far, this all sounds, you know, decent enough. Granted, my memory is very bad, so maybe, <laughs> maybe it's not a good thing. Do I have any units that I need to upgrade? think so but it's been so long i honestly can't remember at this point no look hey, i've overtaken you in military strength I'm not who did that is it me what did i put more troops on my border did you i don't know i have i had a motto set i remember but i thought they all came honestly can't remember if uh if they were there before or not Well, yeah, these ones have been. My musket man, my planes, mechanized infantry, machine gun, field cannon. I have a tank. I thought I had more coming up. Maybe that is it for now. Great general acuteness and discriminative understanding will make no scruple. What is this? Oh. Oh, wait. Shanghai just joined Samaria. Holy shit. I just got an endgame government. <laughs> I'm no longer communist. <laughs> Wait, so China only has one, two, three, uh, four cities now. Hell yeah. Huh. Who's the um, thing that's... Oh, Brazil. Brazil is huge. Wow. Brazil is huge. This is true. Um, I love that frozen wasteland city up to the uh, <laughs> island to the top right. Just barren. Uh, Got some city states on the edges. Sorry, I'm trying to pick. I have a bunch of new government slots that I can do because of um getting that new new government. Uh, grab that. I need that one's pretty good. That one's good. I think that's probably good. Oh, wait. Hold on. Take that one off. Put that one on. And... Hmm. Sorry, I swear I'm almost done. No, oh, that's good. a big message. I'm, I'm going to have to read that. Just saw one that I wanted. Okay, I know I want that one. Okay, 
think. I think I'm good. Confirm. Yes, confirm. Okay, choose production. Um, it's a good question, my guy. What do I want to produce? Ooh, where do I want to say to send? Where do I want to send a trade route? It's probably gonna fail, but. It needs orders. Just skip your turn. Um. Yeah, spread the love of the roulettes. That's good. And you as well. Uh, wait a second. What you four you points away from the diplomatic victory. Oh. Interesting. Um, so I guess, like, here? Unit needs orders. Skip your turn. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Stay on alert. And, okay. Next turn. Okay, not to mention... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, hold on. I missed... Your grandmother ended up reconnecting with him too, which you normally wouldn't have a problem with, but she's changed a lot. She literally said she left this guy because he was a misogynist, which she la later said was a lie. Oh, okay. When you confronted her about this, I don't know if that's true or not. They've only been in contact for like two months. She's already making plans to move down to Florida. Oh, oh yeah, that doesn't sound great. <laughs> that doesn't sound great at all, my guy. Yeah, that sounds like things are moving a little too quickly. Not to mention she spends like six hours a day just talking to him on the phone to the point you asked her what if it's an emergency and she said she would rely on the dogs to let her know if you can't shout. <laughs> Jesus fuck, dude. Okay. I don't know. I mean, obviously I don't know these people IRL or anything, but this sounds a little, a little fucked, man. I'm not going to lie. Like, this doesn't... This doesn't sound good. <laughs> um, holy hell, man. Yeah, that's... That's weird. Not in a good way. Oh, huh. wow. What are you owowing? Um, <clears throat> I did something about 18 turns quicker than what I thought. Nice, dude. Um. Uh. Yes, Lauren. I know you do. Um. Okay. Gilgamesh wants to deal with me, huh? You want aluminum and ivory. Sure. Have fun, my guy. Okay. Uh, very nice. Um, are you useful to me? Not at the moment, so just skip your turn. Spread that religion, my guy. Uh, skip your turn. Next turn. Oh, not next turn. Sorry, I lied. Choose artifact. Uh, da -da -da -da. There we go. Okay, now next turn. Everyone else seems happy. Oh, I read that part. It's nice to know you're not the only one who sees this as an odd... It is weird, man. It's because he's blood family that they don't see an issue. You've honestly been going crazy about this because you're so uncomfortable with the whole situation. Yeah, I don't know. That'd be like, like again, like I don't know the details of this or anything. But to me, it sounds like if my mom just suddenly reconnected with my birth father, like <laughs> that would be really fucking weird, dude. I've never heard a good thing about the guy. 
she's never said a good thing about the guy. So she was all of a sudden was just like, you know what? He actually wasn't all that bad. I think I'm going to get back with him and then move in with him three months later. And all. That would be really fucking weird. And I think that's cause for concern. Like it's your, your opinion sounds perfectly valid and reasonable to me, my guy. <laughs> that's, that's all I'm saying. What you waiting for, my guy? <clears throat> government policies. Oh, you unlocked one. a new uh, government as well? I did not. I'm just changing oh. my policies. You know that uh, has a penalty, right? If you do it when you don't unlock a new government? It's fine. Okay. Just making sure you're trying uh, to help you out, that's all. Some, you know. There we go. I'm back to making good money. There was no penalty. I must have unlocked a government, by the way. Oh, you guys. Did you negotiate peace as well? Who? You? There's oh, no, like I haven't. pieces that were made. Oh, no. I haven't been in war with anything. With anyone. I thought you were in war with China. No, we, we made peace. It's just they keep rebelling oh so that the city. yeah that giant military you got over there it's just yeah well you got it for the rebels know. yeah exactly see i'm glad you understand uh do planes use oil do what use oil planes uh, i think it depends on the plane do they Some have might. to be deployed to be using the oil That'd be I an would interesting thing. I think so, but I don't actually know for sure. Like, I could be wrong I feel like in that. I feel like in Civ, they would just use oil constantly, deployed or not. Well, but they're not really a unit unless they're deployed. Fuck, I don't know what I should do. Okay, I can probably start moving some of these units, honestly. Because Shion is under control now. Not by much, <laughs> granted, but they are under control. Uh, once I get out of this damn dark age, I should be in a lot better position and with them, him. honestly. Shit ton of peace. Oh, Monsa moves so it was in war with someone. Oh, China. Or Japan. What's new? Monsa is always at war with someone. Peace. Power. All right, Push. so. It's 1934. No one needs power. Yep. Oh, really? All of my cities have electricity? <laughs> yeah, mine did, but I'm using my resources for my military. Um... Okay. So let's... What do I want to do? This whole thing has been such a sore spot. Even though we normally get along, we've been having petty arguments over it. That sucks, man. I hope I hope things don't get too bad between you two, regardless of, of whatever happens. I also hope she doesn't just move down there, that she at least, like, gets to know the guy a little bit better before she does anything wild. Because, yeah, dude, like... Feel like that could end up not great. <laughs> okay, that's weird. Hmm. Huh. What the fuck is a tank considered? <laughs> okay. Well, let's I'll mechanize this way, you might need to move out earlier than you think. That sucks, bro. Oh, mechanized is a melee unit. Wait, so why do I still have a musket man? 
Is he not in my territory? No, he is. Look, I don't know the upgrade path oh, for musketmen either. Because musketmen <laughs> no, go I to a, mu yeah. I think musketmen go to a technology I don't have research, but I did research mechanized infantry, so I can build mechanized infantry, but I can't upgrade my musketman. Look, I don't know exactly how this whole tech tree thing works. Um, what? Who stole my off-world mission? That's probably you. Wait, is you what? Off-world mission. Tech. I don't have... No, somebody just stole it from me. Oh. You don't have spies at all? Not operating in territory, no. <laughs> Actually, I haven't been big into the spy game. I, only I have a couple mainly myself. have been spying on China. Because they were ahead of me in tech. China for tech, and then Monsamusa for money was my uh, my main targets. Tbh. Um, what do I want you to do? Honestly, like none of this stuff seems great. Build me a. Would love if you built something that gave you food, honestly. That doesn't seem like an option. Maybe get like an industrial zone or something. Skip turn. Uh, skip turn. Unit needs orders. You're just gonna have to chill, my guy. Same with you. Um, next turn. It's too late for you to order food. You could see some ice cream right now, bruh. It's always a good time for ice cream. Those are just facts. Like, tell you what. Oh, I already hit next turn, that's why. Alright, well, undo my next turn then. Let's get that. And then... And then let's just move down the line, I think. Actually, no, you know what? Let's get that, and then that. Oh god, there's. Uh, I just want everything to be honest, so I don't know if it really even matters. So my child screaming in the background. And then that, and then that. I, I mean, I hear every once in a while, but it's not like a big deal or anything. Man, to go away as a college student loan free. Yeah, that's a huge help, man. Going into like proper adulthood, quote unquote. That is huge, honestly. Oh my god, China's stepping up their religious game hardcore, dude. They're oh, literally they attacking my winning? missionaries. <laughs> like, are they close to winning? I mean, I know they're, like, high up there. No, they're not close. Uh, they're leading. They're the only ones with significant religious... Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, I didn't think they were close. Converted 30 cities so far. Outpaying uh, 104 uh, faith per turn. Okay, skip turn. Choose production. Everybody wants to produce things. Um. Oh wow. What's up? Um. Nothing. Okay. It's a little concerning, to be honest, but... <laughs> All I'm saying is, I'm being a good friend. <laughs> I have no idea what the hell that means. Being a good friend to who? You. Oh, you but ended I'm up being a PlayStation bad Plus. friend. Nice, nice. I'm being a bad friend to my in-game friends. Oh, the coast just rose. 
Oh shit! I have a lot of coastal cities. That's not good. I I haven't been building them flood walls, you know. Oh shit! Is that shit on fire? Yeah, my aqueduct just got pillaged. Man, that's no good. Uh, okay. That sucks. Um... Skip turn. Sorry for the ranting. Oh, no, you're dude. You're dude good. <laughs> you're good, dude. <laughs> Seriously, no worries, man. Shit. Choo-choo is really not doing well. <laughs> we all know I suck at reading and paying attention. I mean, look, it's true. That's true, too, though. <laughs> like, <laughs> the one you said may not have been the one you meant to say, but it's not wrong either, my guy. I forget how... I kind of feel bad because I'm currently converting all of my cities back to coal. Why? Because <laughs> I need my oil for my war machine, all right? What do you need a war machine for? You could just not. Like, that's an option, too. It's to guarantee my nation's prosperity and safety. Okay. I am the peacekeeper of the world. <laughs> You're literally the only person that went at war with somebody for literally no reason. You went to war like, with China. To no stop reason. them from blowing people up with so nukes. You, claim. <laughs> you can literally they, they see the uranium. <laughs> like, it, maybe they were using it for peaceful, you know, nuclear power good. plants. You got to enrich it. You got to learn what about it. What annoys me about this guy is we both know how the AI roughly works. Neither one of us are experts or anything like that. But I'm like 90% sure China's known to be a warmongering nation in Civ. We don't know I could exactly be wrong how they that. work now but with. Uh, no, with I, I, I fully admit, we don't know 100% how they work. But I'm pretty sure <laughs> that he's a well known warmongering nation. Uh, hmm. Yeah, we're friends. Fun. You have oil. Me? Despair. Yeah. Why would I give you oil when you're literally like? <laughs> I'm using it for my cities. You're literally trying to build up your your military right now. You I'm just told me that. Them up. You just said you were converting the coal because you need oil machine. for your military. That's what you just told me. Like, so why would I provide your military with oil? Bruh, come on. Like, just a hater. <laughs> it's it's wouldn't fine. make any fucking I just sense. Bought, I bought it oh. off my friend Pedro. All right, it's fine. Oh, he's just costing me an arm and a leg, but it's fine. I could have helped you with your war game that you got going on there, but I don't have a war game going on. Mm -hmm. I'm not mm -hmm. at war with anyone. In fact, mm. I'm getting ready to pull back most of my units from my border. It's because my supply convoy scared you. You have a supply convoy? Just pulled up. I literally don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I see it now. <laughs> He's hiding in the trees. The bushes. <laughs> the ma the corn. Hiding in the bushes. That's not fucking creepy or anything. Uh... But the real question is, do you have a super airport like I do? <laughs> you mean having yeah. two airports next to each other? No, yeah. You got me beat on that one, dude. I, I fully admit that. You beat me there. Protected by the coastline and my volcano. It could erupt at any moment and destroy um, both of them. Is there a way to sort by... You out here playing yeah, Civ yeah. while I'm playing 4D chess, you know? Uh, <laughs> the absolute quietness after that turn. Oh, sorry, I was trying to. 
I, I literally am trying to pull back my units, but I'm having trouble focusing on which ones I've moved and haven't moved yet and where I have and haven't moved them to already. <laughs> like, Oh, when are you going to play Dwarf for Fortress, by the way? Bro, when I have money to buy Dwarf Fortress. I got it. To be honest, and time. Um, you did just buy it? Game oh, fair, yeah. yeah. You just put away all the dishes thinking you had to empty the dishwasher and it was already empty from the last night. <laughs> Uh, uh opti jack just yeah. got hit with taoism by the way yeah he's going hardcore dude <laughs> like, like oh yeah he super got three hardcore. apostles <laughs> <laughs> surrounding you ultra sun ultra moon do you remember the mant man i never knew how to say that pokemon's name i do not is that something you could actually do like surf on on the pokemon i do not remember that for some reason which sucks because that actually sounds really cool like Oh, there we go. Yes. Give me that. <laughs> so it did have one cool story thing. I like the whole thing with the, uh, like the interdimensional Pokemon and whatnot. I thought that was pretty neat, to be honest. Where are my boats? I mean, I have a battleship there. I have a sub there. Where's the rest of my boats at? Okay, there's one over there. There's one there. One there. Okay. Did like the post game? I said I, th I honestly I enjoyed Ultra Sun Ultra Moon. Well, I didn't play Ultra. Maybe that's why I didn't know about the Man Mantini Mantine surfing or however the hell you say that. Um, because I never actually played Ultra. I only ever played the regular Sun and Moon. So that's probably why. Dude, you need to. It's so cool. I I like. I wanted to get them. I just never got around to it. I never got Black and White too either. I only ever played yeah, the I never first played ones. any of the sequels for any of the Pokemon yeah. games. Yeah, I mean, back in the day, I would play like the special editions, like uh, you know, Yellow, Crystal, um, Emerald, uh, Diamond, Pearl. What was the other one? Diamond, Pearl, Opal, Pla uh, <laughs> Platinum. No, Platinum. What's it yeah. No. Like, I, I, was no. it? I don't fucking remember. I don't but know. anyways, like it, back in the day, I used to play all the special editions. But once they switched from having special editions to fucking sequels, I kind of stopped playing them. Need to play Black and White 2. They're so worth it. I've heard people on both sides of the fence. I've heard people say that it's some of the worst games in the series. And then I've heard other people say Black and White are like the the best of the games since like the originals. So like I do want to. They're just so expensive these days, man. Which fucking sucks. Like world games that i couldn't participate in and in why couldn't you oh because you're the only person in the world that voted against it that's right mm -hmm. i don't like sports that's a lie i do like sports. you know just like irl if there was wow, one look country who won and got the diplomatic point because you're going for the diplomatic victory three points away and the real I told world you you get to 18 or above I'm going we to have war with deal. you, and my friends. You have a my deal. My deal was 18. No, our deal before we started playing was that we would not kill the other unless the rest of the world was killed first. And if somebody starts killing the rest of the world, that was only for the domination victory. I'm not going mm -mm. for domination. Mm -mm -mm. We weren't allowed to kill each other unless we kill everyone else first. That was what the deal. What if I? Okay, that there's was the ways deal. around that. So there's start killing everyone that. else first then, dude. <laughs> no, there's, way, there's ways around that. Before I finish Scarlet and Violet, you generally held the belief that Black and White 2 were the best story for the franchise. I'll go back to it sooner or later, for sure, for sure. Because I do, I do definitely want to try them. Like... Shit is wrong with this place. No amenities, um... barely any housing. I don't care though. <laughs> like, they really want me to build this fucking uh encampments, and I'm like, I don't, I don't care about encampments, dude. <laughs> like, 
I'm not going for a military victory at all. I demand someone goes to war with someone else. Not in this version. War. Not in this version. You could in Civ 5, but not in Civ 6. Trust me, I was upset about that because that used to be one of my favorite things to do was <laughs> Cold Wars. I used to love having Cold Wars, man, but sadly not an option anymore. Are you already... I was approached somewhere? by an individual whom I will not name that he wanted to go to war with you and wanted me to go as well. That is all I'm going to say. Luxury policy. Duplicates of the chosen luxury. I don't really care. Um... I don't even know what luxuries I have. Uh, shit. God, what do I have? I mean, that's fine. I don't. I don't know what do I have either. I know I have amber. I'm pretty sure I have amber, so I'm just gonna vote yes on that. Uh. Chosen player generates 100% more grievances. And other players generate more towards this player. Uh, China. Next. Whoops, that would have been a smart pick. Although China now has very limited resources, and there is one player sitting on a pile of uranium right now. Need some lemonade and some strawberry puree drink mix? Why? Oh, my mom sent raisin cookies? I like raisin cookies. All these haters when you're getting so close to winning the game, dude. It went Imagine through. that. It went through. I'm looking at the number, and I think it went through. The number of what? Your diplomatic points. Oh, did they drop? I think. It's I'm still loading, surprised. but if I hover over you, it says 15. Yes. 46 yeah. of us. Oh, my God. That's why I didn't even put any votes into it. It's <laughs> stupid to do so. Wait, what? <laughs> raisin cookies are a scam? Raisin cookies are a cruel lie? I like raisin cookies, dude. I have nothing against raisin cookies. I think they are delicious. You all voted to have less grievances towards you? If someone goes to war with you? What? No. It was... The, you chose someone to generate more grievances, but everyone generates more grievances against them. Oh, well, it passed on you. Okay. <laughs> well, no, that it passes on, I think, whoever you voted for or something. I don't know. I didn't look at the results that much. I didn't really care. I don't know. And Diamonds got elected. Okay. Back to this, I suppose. Wait, they awarded me? What? I got two diplomatic victory or points. Cool. If you vote with the rest of the world, you get diplomatic victory points. Oh, wow! You must have really researched that, huh? No, that's like mm. <laughs> that's not some mm. big secret, man. That's just how the game works. Really researching it. Oh my god, this guy. I'm six points away from the whole world ending. Chocolate covered raisins, dude. Chocolate covered chocolate covered raisins are amazing. I do seriously love me some chocolate covered raisins. Mansa Musa just sent me a warning. Aren't we friends? We are friends. We're declared friends, and he sent me a warning. Sent me a message too. I can't see it yet because the game's still loading, but. They're hardly labeled, get hype, think, oh yeah, Choco Chip, but no, it's raisins. I've never once bit into a raisin cookie thinking it was something else. Oh, it's because I'm not religious. Oh, who cares? He has a nice beard. Went to the barber today. 
and like what little mustache I can grow. She cut, she like trimmed only one side and then got into the story <laughs> and forgot the other side. I had to go home and like fix it. Oh man. Um, I hope that's Noodle breaking into the room. If I die, I'm sorry, guys. Somebody's breaking into the room. If you die, room. I technically win. So <laughs> nah, I'll just let somebody else play for me, dude. They can kick your ass. Oh, yeah, yeah. Noodle brought me up the noodle. Or Noodle brought me up the noodle. <laughs> ah, Noodle brought me up raisin cookies. Wait, why that's okay. Sometimes two? friends need warned, but it's not always justified. What the fuck? Um, what do I want to build? Uh, honestly, yeah. I wish there was a button so it's like, hey, if this oh, unit is you. going to be useless, just skip their turn automatically. <laughs> like Researching satellites to launch the moon landing, huh? Or you, you already know? researched satellites. You're working on the moon landing. You want to know what I did legitimately? Like 100%. I clicked the very last thing in the technology wow. tree. <laughs> Look and at I that. Just said, Mr. Noodle that <laughs> is producing Operation <laughs> Ivy. Hell yeah, yeah. Isn't that thermonuclear bombs? Thermonuclear devices, yeah. You oh. gotta get that to get the end game, dude. To get the fucking yeah, okay. uh, Mars mission going. Mm. If you oh, die, so you are getting science, huh? Noodle, if you die, who will I watch on Twitch? Uh, you guys will just have to bug John to... To, uh... Why, well, you're not gonna send start streaming my boy more. David? He, does, he never even streams anymore, dude. <laughs> like... <laughs> uh... I was commemorated for discovering how to mitigate global warming. Better this malefactor I'm to just adding to it. It's fun. In adamantine bonds infrangible. Um, there needs to be a fucking search screen or, or search bar or something in the fucking policies for governments. There's so many here. Like, <laughs> bruh. Uh, um... Going. What is? What are you even doing? Oh, I haven't been. Rather Rue oh. take care of Noodle than Doors. Wait, what? No, I was talking about. I was talking about they can watch Doors stream. I wasn't talking about who to take care of you. You freak. Gilgamesh sent me a message. Gilgamesh loves me. I love you too, Gilgamesh. Monsmusa sent me a message. Very warmonger. He likes you. me. I got you. I discovered how to mitigate global warming. The world loves me more for it. Yep, you're welcome. Um, uh, what do I want to build now? Ruo, don't worry, Noodle. That's sweet. Ru takes care of you. Doris picks up the streaming. And you'll become the new occasional co-host. There you go, guys. See? We got it figured out. When I get murdered, everything's going to be okay. Just watch out, because turn... when I do get murdered, it's probably going to be Noodle that does it. After this turn, i got to change your diaper. Oh, my God. After this turn, our boys got to take a break, guys. No. Uh, let's get a zoo or something. I don't know. All right. I'll be right back. Unit needs orders. Skip turn. Unit needs orders. Skip turn. Skip turn. Okay, so what units are still chilling over here? I got my fighter jets, who apparently has a promotion that I never did, so. Um, this guy. That he can stay there for now. I have these jets that can 
Oh wait, they're okay. They're already based. You can't do anything because you're there. You're based there. You're chilling there. Okay, so I think I might need to build one or two more units. I want to have a unit on every uh, city because you get bonuses for that. Or at least I get bonuses for that because of some of the options that I picked. Um, hmm. Noodle, do you have a favorite evolution? Uh, I feel like if for Noodle, it'll probably be that pink one. I can't remember the name of it, but I feel like it'll probably be that one. Uh, while we wait for Optijack to get back, I'm going to run a quick ad, guys. Uh, I'm not actually going anywhere, but like, because <laughs> I just don't feel like getting up, but might as well since we're not actually doing any playing for a few minutes anyways. So how are you guys doing tonight, man? You got it all figured out. You'll be missed, but your dream carried on. Who's going to finish collecting all the, the PS2 games? Because that's my, my dream currently, right? To collect and try every PlayStation 2 game. I'm back. Like, legitimately collect and try. We wow, can't play and I'm for still another, waiting on you. Can't play for another two and a half minutes because I, I just decided to run an ad after I finished oh my Oh, my God. <laughs> but, anyways. Your uh, uncle so who's gonna So who's going to do that? Sylveon and Espeon are very cute. I figured you'd pick Sylveon. I forgot about Espeon. Oh, uh, remind me to tell you after stream uh, I how this stream band, my dream love. how this band formed in the span of twenty four hours. He's probably sleeping, Lauren. You and Doris will carry the torch. Thanks, Nate. Thanks, man. Just warning you, man. It's not an ex it's not a uh, cheap dream. It's not like as expensive as you might think. Go ahead, guess, guys, how much you think it'll be roughly to collect every ps2 game it's not cheap but it's not under one million dollars I, I mean he's technically correct <laughs> like, exactly it's not a good guess but <laughs> he's technically correct five hundred dollars yep it, that's how much it costs to collect every ps2 game five ish grand five hundred dollars i can tell you for sure it's over five hundred dollars um is it over 900? 9,000? Yes. I fucked up. I fucked up the Dragon Ball meme. <laughs> wasn't, that, wasn't that even... It was wasn't a it a translation error anyway? Yeah. yeah. It has a translation problem anyways. Now, After it's, uh, watching... It's over, it's over 9,000. It's roughly... Um, I forget exactly what the average cost of a PS2 game is. I think it was around 13 to $15, or something like that. So if I say 13... And I know there's about 1,700 games, so it's about $22,000. Um, it's not as much as I expected, but <laughs> so it's somewhere between like twenty and 30000 basically. I mean, if you buy like loose, you could save a little bit of money compared to buying like complete and all that stuff. Beg pardon, how much? Uh, between twenty and $30,000, yes, yeah. And that's why I am not turning Twitch streaming into a business because the IRS would laugh at me <laughs> when I told him, yeah, I'm running a legitimate business. This is my plan. This is how I'm going to make money from it. Yeah, no, this is 100% a hobby, guys. That's, <laughs> that's why I do not take this too seriously because, yeah, how much? See, honestly, though, I thought it was going to be a lot more than that, to be completely honest. But yeah, when you remember that there's 17, almost 1,800 games for the PS2, and then you multiply that by a minimum of $10 per game on average, like, that right there is 20 grand. Like, yeah, dude. Crazy, right? A hobby that costs taxes, yeah. <laughs> I mean, technically, I make some money off of it if you pretend that... that you know, I'd spend no time on it and have no costs. <laughs> but to to actually make money on it now, to be fair, that twenty to thirty thousand, I plan on splitting up over the course of at least ten years, right? So that means that I would need to make at least three thousand dollars a year on Twitch, um, to to have a chance of breaking even. Once you consider like taxes and whatnot. And uh, I don't know if you're allowed to talk about how much you make on Twitch, but I think it's safe to say I don't make $3,000 a year. <laughs> let's, let's make that clear. All right, I next turned. A 
Okay. So how are we gonna get those donos? <laughs> Honestly, the the best way to grow the channel monetarily is just to grow the channel in general. We just need more people to watch, um, to tune in, to join, to have fun with us. Like, thankfully, most of the games he's bought were less than ten dollars. Yeah. Well, I mean, again, the average price of a PS2 game is only like fifteen dollars or something like that, thirteen to fifteen dollars, somewhere around there. It's just because like, there's so many of them, and then there are a handful that are that are more expensive. You see, a hurricane's about to hit China. I did not. Oh wait, it's heading west. Never mind. Oh well, it's just hitting open ocean. I I don't know much, but I do know things heading west don't normally hit the east. Yeah, just... that's a good. That's a good. <laughs> like, just there. just throwing that out there. I could be wrong on this though. Like I'm not the brightest person in the Why world does he want diplomatic favor uh okay. what can so you do you can dip just... diplomatic favor that's like you're vo voting in the congress yeah right? that's voting and you can trade with it that's all it is for can't do anything else with it Jeez. um interesting skip turn, skip turn. Uh, how can I see how much I have? Oh, there it is. You can. Oh, you lose turn. some from having carbon emissions. Yes. Yikes. Yes, you do. That's no good. Speaking of which, how's the climate looking? We're heading towards a uh, climate phase three. Nice, nice. I'm working on carbon recapture, but sadly, I don't think I by myself can <laughs> save the world. Interestingly of the climate enough, crisis. you still have a uh, large. The largest uh, CO2 emission. Considering, though, that every single one of my up, cities but... has power, I think I'm like uh -oh. doing pretty decent, all things considered. I don't Grow have any cities account. up there. I've thought about trying to do some, some Patreon stuff and whatnot, but honestly, I would rather just give stuff to people that sub on Twitch, to be 100% honest. That's why instead of like the, the six-hour game jams that I'm doing... Instead of putting those behind a Patreon paywall or something, it's just for all the people that sub on Twitch. So, that's that's how I feel about it. I mean, maybe someday it would be worth it to me or something, but right now our community's so small that, you know, it just I just don't think it's worth it. So, that volcano by Uathaya uh, or whatever the shit. Yeah, you lost me, my right, guy. Yeah, right of Xi'an, the purple <laughs> city-state. Oh, okay, uh, yeah. was a mega colossal volcano nice eruption. dude deadliest explosion known to mankind it says only Very one nice. population was lost though so it wasn't that deadly but. no i was gonna say that that sounds pretty tame actually dude <laughs> i was like i wish more volcanic eruptions were like that uh from mega super volcanoes or whatever the fuck you said they were called colossal i think colossal mega Sword super colossal what's the same damn thing ain't it what the shit is this for, Beijing? Um, did I do the same thing for the civics tree? I did do the same thing for the civics tree. I just clicked the very last thing and just like, <laughs> have fun. <laughs> cool. need to write your laptop off as a tax write-off since i bought it for school see and that's like if i claim twitch streaming as a business that's the fun stuff i could do i could write off video games as a, a business expense my console purchases etc um new computer gear like there's a lot of stuff i could write off the problem is the irs changed um what's classified as a uh, business a handful of years ago um, so now most small businesses that people used to use to write stuff off, at least, would now be considered hobbies. And uh, one of the things you have to prove if you want to claim a hobby as a business is that it can be profitable or that there's a reasonable reason to believe it will be profitable if you keep dumping the money you're dumping into it or whatever. And so things like Twitch streaming can be very hard to uh, write off or to use to write off tax expenses because the chance of actually making money off of it is very slim unless you don't claim any business expenses, which technically I probably could do, <laughs> um, but it, that wouldn't necessarily be truthful either. So like, yeah. 
And it wouldn't really help anything anyways at that point, right? If I claimed it as a business but not a hobby but then didn't write off any of my expenses, then what's the point of claiming it as a business to begin with? It just doesn't make much sense. Also, I think I might have put a bunch of my units to sleep when I meant to skip turn. Yeah, I guess it's not that big of a deal. Fire ended. That's good. Some people need housing. Yeah, yeah, I get it, dude. Noodle, you got the Espeon. Let's go. Bob knocked the rug onto the top step, so be careful coming down. Oh, good. So what you're saying is I'm probably going to die trying to come down the stairs. <laughs> Optijack, while I got you here, so I don't forget my guy, are you still coming over on Monday? Uh, I'm not positive. This guy. This guy. Never make plans with him. He's flaky. I live a busy life. <laughs> uh, okay, skip turn. What do field cannons upgrade to? <laughs> Legitimately, question. Field like, cannons, yeah. artillery. What? I have artillery unlocked. Like, I legitimately wait, no, own field artillery. Cannons, field yeah. cannons. Uh. Wait, no, that's machine guns. I thought field cannons were a siege unit. Oh, I don't fucking know, dude. I I built I have a drone to fly with it because so I thought I. it was... Oh, or no, God, no, I, I have that with my artillery, not with my field cannon. But yeah, no, I don't I don't know what the hell they, they come or they, they upgrade to. Because I have a lot of tech, but somehow I don't have the tech for fucking field cannons, apparently. I'm running around with stealth bombers, nuclear devices, nuclear submarines, and cannons from the fucking 1700s. Like, that makes sense, dude. <laughs> Mr. Noodle says you have to come meet your new niece. <laughs> yeah, I know. Were you talking to me or your child? No, you. Uh, she absolutely loves people. She loves people about as much as your daughter loves people. Oh, wow. So, Nate, if you're still there, man, are you going to share with them the other secret that you figured out but haven't discovered how to access yet in the game? This guy discovered that there is something else in the game, and I confirmed it for him since he thought he knew it and asked me about it. But the only secret you actually know to be in the game... <laughs> But you don't know how to do yet. I'm not going to say it, because as far as I know, no one else has figured it out except for you. And you only really figured it out because you had help from someone else. <laughs> not me, to be fair. A third party. Um, but yeah. How did you regain a diplomatic point? Oh, from carbon recapture. Mm. Helping to save the world. Oh, look at that. How to win? Well, no, I know you... Never mind, man. <laughs> if you've forgotten, that's fine. But, uh, no. Oh, you built an old world wonder. Congrats. That's not good. Uh, that's, a, that's a pretty big... That's a pretty big issue. What's a pretty big issue, my guy? Something. Okay. That's confidential. See, we could help each other out if you were just willing to to talk mm. with me, my guy. Yeah, no, this ain't the type of thing. It's Main fine. I can get my supply from the... China. Oh, yeah. Um, Noodle also was saying that Maine Coons are, are less uh, allergy-inducing. If you need resources, I'm maxed out on everything. I'll take of all of your uranium. Gold. Obviously, I'm not giving you all of my uranium. That's, oh, fine. I will deal with China, then. It's okay. Okay. Never mind. China just sent me a warning. <laughs> <laughs> Even though they just sold me uranium a couple turns ago. Uh, Noodle did say your niece, uh, your new niece might bite your toes, though. So be careful about um, that. She is a toe biter. <laughs> Why is that? She likes playing with feet. Look, I don't know. We try not to kink shame around here. <laughs> um, 
I need winning the hidden item, the book. You know of another oh, thing in the game that you while. haven't figured out how to do yet, my guy. But that's why, like I said, if you forgot, man, that's that's fine. Something for someone else to actually discover in the game. We're just waiting on Optijack. He'll get around eventually, man. Just the change? What do you mean, the change? Got to be more specific than the change, my guy. Okay, does... Does Monza just hate me that much, or does he not have any money? Like, he might just hate me that much. Or no, okay, he must just hate diamonds, because he's willing to give me money for oranges. I guess he just doesn't like diamonds for some reason. Wait, were something voted against diamonds? Like, are they worse for some reason? Uh, I thought they were better, actually. Huh. I don't know. <laughs> what, does anybody else want my diamonds? I don't think anyone else really has money, though. Besides Monza, to be honest with you. He's kind of funding the world right now. Oh, Gilgamesh has a bunch of diamonds, so he's not going to want them. You getting your shower now? Enjoy, love. To change character, yes, yeah, no, the the ability to change characters, yeah, that's it, my guy. Now China doesn't want, or not China, uh, Japan doesn't want diamonds either. I think they were voted to be worse, not better. Oh, never mind, they don't want pearls either. Huh. Really? I know you don't want to just straight give me money, but like... I'm trying to figure out what you want for your money, my guy. I mean, I'm not like hurting for cash. I'm making money just fine, but... It's always nice to have more. Got that research lab... Got them governors. You proposed the deal. What kind of stupid ass deal is this gonna be? It's <laughs> not for warmongering purposes. It's to maintain my. I actually been slimming down my military because uh, I don't have a lot of resources within my own country. So uh, that's just to cover what military I have left. Truthfully. For a while. I accepted. Feel like I'm going to end up regretting it, but <laughs> I accepted. No. I mean, you've only threatened to go to war with me like 20 times now. So. I've never directly threatened you. <laughs> you've threatened plenty of times, sir. And also, what's with all these units on your border? I cleared mine out, like I said I would, as soon as Xion was under control. Um, and look at that. We got well, a tank. We have a lot we got of rebels. mechanized infantry. We have no rebels, hence why I pulled my uh, units the out. The potential. We got machine guns, supply convoys, musketmen, another machine. Oh, machine gun core. Look at that. I don't know. It's making, making me a little Fake uncomfortable news. over here, guy. Fake news. Um, I don't want it. <laughs> I'm protecting myself from China. Because they had that uranium, you know, that they sold me. <laughs> it's making me wary. And then they threatened me after they sold me their uranium, so, I, you know. Uh, and then you're also researching operation ivy which is nearing completion in 19 turns hmm. wow and you just took my suzerain status you've taken over half of mine my guy <laughs> like... but i've been letting you get them back 
Um, create an escort, I guess. I don't really care what you do. I got a great admiral, and I really don't care about the great admiral, to be honest. But, like, why not take it, you know? Uh, skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Uh, skip turn. Next turn. Hmm. Rapa Nui? What the hell is Rapa Nui? I'm not sure about that. It must be a city state, Pedro, just to clarify. Yeah. All oh, but when I do it, it's the end of the world. I mean, I'm totally willing to go to war with Pedro over that. Pedro is also a... totally willing to war go to war with you. He was the one who uh, asked me to join the war against you. If there's any work in the afterlife. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Pedro wants to go to war with me. <laughs> yeah. Well, he asked me to join. <laughs> Fucking, did you tell him to? You should have just told him, bro. No. Just go ahead. Well, I don't want to. Well, go, go, go it was against the rules. I, like... You said I couldn't join the war with <laughs> you. Just... <laughs> oh, my God. Even like... It's 458, my guy. <laughs> I mean, listen, I'm sitting at 1,180 uh, plus. Why is Mansa Musa buffed up right now? Oh, he hates he's, me at the moment. We have an alliance yeah, he's together, so he can't do anything, but he hates me at the moment. So, <laughs> like, what kind of military does he have, though? Probably nothing, to be honest. Where's my. Oh, here you are. Um. Does that not... Okay, it does count. Oh, you fucking bitch. You. Fucking Molly. He's got a settler over here in the middle of my shit again. <laughs> Wait, where at? Uh, fucking Ruman. He's got a, he's got a settler inside Ru. <laughs> That's really pissing me the hell off. Oh no, don't go to sleep. Uh, wake up. Don't sleep. Skip. Uh, After this game ends, are we doing another series? Probably, yeah. I, I would like to do one where we're actually on a team, if we can figure out a way to have teams. Um, Screw that. I'm buying the overpowered DLC, and we're having a rematch. <laughs> Just because I, I want to be able to talk about what the hell I'm doing. So if if I mean, we do, can right do now. that way, I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to do uh, push to talk. That's all. Push to talk for you, That'd yeah. Which isn't that big of a deal, but I've been enjoying our series. I love Civ. So have I. I love we Civ too. I can play Civ every seven all the years. fucking time, dude. Why did he denounce me, China? You they just, just gave me Pedro. uranium, and now you're going. Oh, it's because we occupy one of their cities. <laughs> that's why he denounced me, at least. I assume that's why he denounced you, too. I understand. There we go. I okay. would be mad, too. There we go. Field cannons upgrade to... Yeah, field cannons upgrade to machine guns. How the hell did I not have machine gun tech? I have nuclear weapons. You just got that? How did I not have machine gun tech? I guess that's what I get for just fucking... Jumping straight to... Um, whatchamacallit. <laughs> what this up? is great wait will it not oh because i gotta select multiple yes uh yes and yes confirm <laughs> hold on i'm sending them over to your border <laughs> do you see him no. By Xion. By Xion? I'm coming up now. <laughs> what? Oh, you mean the losing the loyalty? 
No, my unit. Oh, your giant death robot. Nice, dude. <laughs> yeah. Should I bring mine over? Yeah, they can. They can talk. <laughs> they can be friends with each other. <laughs> Wait, did you hit a gold arrow too? Can I make it too? that far? Yeah, I can't make it that far. Here you go. He's coming. I actually have the uh, advanced model. I'm not even joking. I really do have the advanced model of giant death robot. <laughs> That's another technology that you can unlock. No, I've been building giant death robots. Oh. <laughs> uh, I need this. Where is it? There you go. There's mine. He's saying hello. Does mine look different since it's the advanced model? Yeah, mine's got uh, yellow jump packs on the back of it. Ooh. Oh, this Time is civic come, dumbass. And is inevitably coming when all institutions based Technology. on I need this. Oh fuck me. Ah. Huh? Take a look at that science victory that you're going towards now that you can't win diplomacy quickly. What do you mean? Oh, Pedro's going towards science victory as well. Yeah, I was surprised. You guys should go to war. I thought you were going to notice that I was building giant death robots because no, Nate, Nate A has been building one, and that's close enough to your city. So I was like, surely he's going to see that I'm building giant death robots. But... Speaking of which, why can I see inside Mr. Noodle? You have an embassy. Like, there's no fog of war. Oh, embassy. Shit. Embassy gives you some spy stuff without yeah, having actual I, spies. I didn't realize I had an embassy with you. Um, if I put you to sleep, will that still leave? I hope that still leaves the actual ship awake, at least. Wait, so how few of units do you have? That I'm close to you in military strength, but you're that advanced. What do you mean? I, I'm i behind on some stuff, like field cannons. <laughs> you tried yeah, the Konami yeah. code? That's a good idea. I am the type of person that would hide things with the Konami code, but no. Yeah, my tech's a little out of whack. Like, I also have stealth bomber tech, but I haven't built any stealth bombers yet. <laughs> Uh, that's why I'm not really worried about my, my military much, because if I do get attacked, I can just change all of my production to military and have a massive military in no time. That's the other reason why I'm keeping all of my uh, resources capped. That way, if I suddenly need to build up a huge military, it's not a problem. I have every resource known to man, so. Because you were a warmonger, got the uranium from China. It helps figure something out, though. What'd you figure out, my guy? Hey, the rainforest regrew. Yeah. Ooh, Sorry. Pedro just sent me a proposal. I wonder what that could be about. He also sent me a... Uh, well, he sent me a warning, so he's probably sending you another war, war alliance there. Not alliance, but war uh, thing. Is it against the rules if I accept? Because I better go, directly... go to bed. You gotta go to work at 10.30 and you gotta walk to it tomorrow. That sucks, dude. Have a good night, though, Rue. Thanks for coming and hanging out. I mean, you can By do whatever you want, wake up tomorrow, but if you I attack me, I'm game. allowed to attack you. Yes, you just can't take my capital. Pedro until you've taken everyone else. sent you a warning. Um, hmm, that's tempting. Why would I give you oil, Pedro, to go to war... <laughs> Because he doesn't that have I would anything. Have a bigger influence he in. just wants you to fight his war for him. Is literally all. He wants that me is. to give him diplomatic favor too. Like he's I said, going he to give me gold. Just wants That's you it. to fight his war for him. That's what he's trying give to get you to do. Give me. But. Three. It of is your good cities. exercise. That's fair. I'll give you that much. Bye, Pedro. Um, I can't. Interesting. Uh, 
Oh. Uh, okay, skip turn. Sent you a deal. Skip turn. Deal proposed? <laughs> no. I would be willing to give that city to you for the right price, to be uh, honest. I don't want that but... city. I would... Oh, wait. <laughs> The only reason I, I built I that city was to help Xion. that I want. Which one has the uranium tile? Uh, don't worry about that. Why the hell would I tell you that? If it's Xion, I would take Xion, but Xion <laughs> wouldn't... I couldn't ask for Xion for some reason. I don't know why, honestly. Oh, because it's a capital, I bet. It's still original. It's an original capital, so I would assume you can't take capitals. Maybe. Maybe? I honestly don't because know. Because if either. I if I needed a domination victory, would I have to take Xion as well? Because it's original capitals? Yeah. Or is it just Yeah, you would have to take okay. Xion as well. Okay. As far as I'm so, aware, yeah, you I have to have it wouldn't allow you to win through diplomacy. Anyways, I think I a want? domination through diplomacy victory would be a cool concept. I know I really wish that they still had the ability to do the uh the, the, the Cold Wars and stuff, yeah. I don't joint, know why they yeah. got rid of that. I really like that feature in, in 5. My only issue with multiplayer with that, and it still happens with certain things, I wish the pop-ups for that sort of stuff wouldn't apply until, like, the next turn when, like, the AI is doing their things. Because it's, like, obviously... It's, That's pretty it was very cool. obvious during Civ 5 when <laughs> you would have someone declare a war on me, like, 10 minutes yeah, into the Yeah, because it did it, yeah, in the middle of the Instantly turn. Instantly instead of... Yeah. yeah. That's my only issue. That's true. So is it only... Oh, wait. That's just a regular giant death robot. Why can't I... Can what, mine, mine not go in the water? Oh, no, no. I can jump it. Do you have the jump command? When you click on your no, giant death robot? Yeah, that's why. I can I can oh, jump him you... a long distance if I want to. Oh, like, ba basically, he's a paratrooper. Um, okay, I'll tell you what then. Just like move here and then move back. There you go. Now I can skip turn with you. Yeah, yours should still be able to go in the water. I'm pretty sure. I just wanted to try it. That's the only reason I jumped into the water. Probably going to put him back over there so he can be friendly with you. Say hello and stuff. Mansa Musa built Broadway. Aren't you fancy? China, we don't have to hate each other. I do have grievances against you. And you are a communist. Hmm. you have any uranium for the taking? I know you're producing it somewhere. That or you gave me what little was left in your stockpile after somebody forcefully took it from you. <laughs> Where's my other paratrooper at? No. Oh, so, wait. Or spec ops. I thought I had another one. Whatever. Eh, just keep it the way it is for now. Uh, okay. Skip turn. Skip turn, skip turn, and skip turn. And guess what? Skip turn. I wish there was a message for like whenever things can be upgraded. Because that's the only reason I don't have all my units put to sleep right now. Yeah. There you go. You watching my giant death robot? Yeah, I saw him. <laughs> It'd be funny if whenever he landed on a tile, he just smashed whatever was under it. <laughs> like. Artillery, skip turn. Skip turn. Okay, next. 1952. 1953. Oh, it only goes by a year now. Yeah, the later you get, the slower it goes. Building what? 
building that. Oh, we're waiting. Gong yeah. Gong Zhao's about to uh revolt. So I don't know how I feel about like Who's at first favorite? I really liked it. What's that? The uh the like map effect for the fog of war, but it kinda gives me like a headache. <laughs> Cause like the detail that's still within it is cool and all, but like I don't know. Sometimes it gets a little muddied up. Um, a lot to process. To My brain hurts. Death robot, probably not. To be honest, uh, I mean sewers are nice. No, not a fucking tile. Which is, uh, yeah, one of those. Thank you. Um. love that I can still build frigates, like, come on, who's building frigates right now? Let's build... I have frigates, sir. Or no, I don't have battleships. Plus three. Not bad, yeah. Why does Molly have a submarine over here? Uh, by your submarine, just a heads up. You Do you really need to ask change. why? <laughs> like, again, the dude hates me. Actually, it says he's still friendly with me, but he hasn't been acting so friendly. <laughs> uh, yeah, skip turn. I'm digging your giant death robot sitting by your field cannon. <laughs> that's by my musket man right? and my giant death right? robot <laughs> isn't that fucking nice dude while you're uh working towards producing yeah. nuclear or yeah happy now uh, I, I forgot that one was there so i upgraded them to a which machine one? gun oh that one <laughs> uh, wake up because i keep forgetting these dudes are here but uh, skip turn Turn. Skip turn. Turn. Clear. Skip turn. Oh, fusion. Fuck. Fusion. Yeah, okay. Which one's the one that makes? Fusion's the powerful one. Fission's the weak. I mean, one. they're both pretty. Right. You said fusion's <laughs> the big one. Yeah. The big big boom. Yeah. There's Operation Ivy, and then you built the thermonuclear device. Yeah. Yep. 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 <laughs> 16 gold per for maintenance per one of those. Mm -hmm. Regular nuclear device devices are 14. <laughs> like, whew. So why are you building uh, thermonuclear bombs? I'm for not actually. Purpose? Operation Ivy just lets me build them. Mm. But I haven't actually uh, decided to build any. Um, okay, you're building that. What do I want to do? do right now it's actually a pretty tough question um while wow, molly is now stronger than anyone in the world through military really? strength points at least yes wow he's at 1765 you're at 1500 i'm at 1300 <laughs> everyone else is either at zero or like low hundreds so what if he decides to declare them? war i can very quickly why did pedro just send me a warning but... what is going on Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I remember now. Um, where? Is... Oh god, that scared me a little bit. Reading. What are we gonna get? Oh, oh, he looks. He looks kind of funky. <laughs> Yeah, he's he's looking a little a little funky, dude. Uh, okay.
Didn't turn out as cute as I thought. The dragon I picked was so cute. Guess you'll just have to keep doing it, dude. Uh, yeah, you... Pocket artillery? No, I don't want any of that. I do kind of want... A submarine or something, though. I don't quite trust Monza with what he's got going on. Not gonna lie there. Oh. Hey, some steak for him. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you. He was getting hungry. As am I. <laughs> Just uh, finished launching the Mars colony. Now only has two more objectives to get the uh, science victory, huh? Interesting. Do you want diamonds yet, Monsa? No. Wow, you you're really Why beating around the bush. Diamonds, dude? The bush About has what? been beat. You going for the science victory? Hmm. Mister, I don't think I'm going for the science victory. That one's like too simple and easy. <laughs> Never mind. Um, Monza actually does like me. He's perfectly willing to go to war with me, if I ask. Against uh, Pedro. I'm an alliance As with him. Hey, we won! Let's go. 21 fought, 12 won. Wait, what? 21 fought, only 12 won? I thought we had a higher win-loss ratio than that. Maybe we got in a couple fights while we weren't paying attention or something. <laughs> what were you saying? Sir, what bro? are you talking about? The dragon on the stream. You really oh. need to join the stream more often. <laughs> I mean, I'll pull up your screen right now if you want me to. Uh, not right this minute, but just in general, you know? I'm a busy man. Support your local sex I'll get home till like 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I hopped in. Why did you get home so in, damn late? You, you get done at 11 o'clock, sir. No. I don't normally get the clock out till like 11.30, 11.45, and then I got some shopping to do, like, and then problem solved. by the time I'm done with my shopping, sometimes I have to drop off stuff for the kids. I drop that stuff off. By the time I get home, it's late. Last time I pulled up your stream, you're ending it. Mm -mm -mm. You need to just stream later. Imagine... Being that fucking late getting home, dude, when you get off at 11. <laughs> like, Technically, I get off at 11, but I don't really get off at 11. I'm just saying that's kind of trash, bro. Uh, technically, this isn't illegal, so I'm going to do it. Technically, this isn't illegal? <laughs> it has been said a four times yes. that he who knows both sides I need you has nothing to fear. To not do that no longer. Wait, that didn't destroy you, did it? Oh no, I didn't. Okay. Yes. Monza. Yep. I got a big navy. Hojo. <laughs> he wants my oil. In return, he wants 20 barrels of oil. He's going to give me 10 gold and open borders. And he also wants my ivory. I mean, this all sounds fair. Uh, he has oil already. He yes, oil. I will. I will give you 20 of my oil, or 10 of my oil, if you give me all 11 of yours. He refuses. Therefore, I refuse. Um. Sedova, yeah. Uh. Yeah, build that. Do that. See you starting to Honestly, work on your exoplanet expedition. Would be so much easier if I didn't have to deal with you. Me? Yeah. 
Because I would get rid with? of like 80% of my units right now if I didn't have to worry about you suddenly deciding to go on a warmongering you spree. You don't have to worry about anything. I don't have nuclear bombs like you do. We both know nukes are as be... powerful as you wish they were in this game. I don't know. With all the pollution and shit they cause, you could really fuck the world up. Yeah, like if you attack someone's like. capital with it or something, it definitely sucks, but... It's and not they like kind of negate the win. need for... Well, no, but they negate a lot of need for uh, a shit ton of siege units. I've been denounced. Imagine that. Pedro wants an embassy. I would say invisibility. Sure. Who denounced you? China. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, no surprise at all. Okay. You can go to... Oh, excuse me. Wait. Oh, it's probably a bomber that gets upgraded to stealth bombers, huh? Should have built a couple bombers before I decided to unlock that. I just realized, like, hey, none of my fucking airplanes upgraded. Why not? And then I was like, wait a second. <laughs> I have regular airplanes, not bombers. That's probably why. Oh well. Okay. I need you to go over here, sir. I need you to go over here, other sir. You fuck. I don't even know what to do with you. Oh, uh, hey, you got some spec ops now, too. Nice, man. I've had spec ops. Now we both have parachute, uh, para paratroopers. My, that spec ops trooper's been sitting there for, like, 15 turns. I haven't been paying any attention to your military. I don't plan on going to war with you, so. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> oh? <laughs> okay. Ooh, oh, look somewhere. at that. Catastrophic. Catastrophic. Jesus. Uh -huh. By Joe's Crab Shack, right That's on so my nice. city. Uh, I lost one population. It ain't that big, nah. big of a deal, I guess. Just population control. Two That's tiles all. were damaged as well. That's pretty communist of you. <laughs> I'm not communist, sir. Slightly fascist, potentially. I have an uh, endgame. Shit, I don't even remember what my Refuse. government's actually called. Hold on, how do you see your government again? <laughs> government. I am a synthetic techno technocracy. Thank you. Interesting. It's an and it's, it's I think it's actually the last government that you unlock normally in a in a normal layout. I really wish one of these other things would finish that I've been building. Would be nice. Unless I'm just blind. Which is always a possibility. Why does Granada have uh, almost purely AT crews? Granada? Couldn't tell you. They, to the right of Joe's Crab Shack, they have one, two, three, four, five units, military units, and out of those five, four of them are AT crews. Guess they just really like 
AT Cruise. Oh, it's just. Oh, it's just the counter. Skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Skip turn. Next turn. If you come over Monday. Oh, <laughs> Noodle said if you come over on Monday, I have some whiskey you can have or drink or try or whatever. That nasty shit the pain try to feed me. And no, pain. no, the gentleman's shack is gone. Uh, no, it's Wild Turkey 101. That's even worse. How's that even worse? Do you don't like whiskey. Whiskey's okay. You just don't whiskey's like whiskey. Whiskey's okay if I'm absolutely sloshed and we're doing shots <laughs> of it so I don't have to taste it. Uh I, I slow you know drink the worst whiskey, whiskey or mix it with like lately root beer. Back in the day, it was like you know Coke, but it's really good with root beer. Whiskey's okay. Like it, honestly, it's okay. I'm not a huge fan of a lot of whiskeys. Um, the worst whiskeys though are like Irish whiskeys. I can't do Irish whiskeys. We I haven't had, had that proper... many to be completely honest with you. So, yeah. The boys from work Irish and I when we used to go to the bar. Uh, we did shots of proper 12 and Jameson. Oh, oh. Noodle said, well, oh. she has some pink Whitney if you'd rather drink some pink Whitney. I don't know what that is, but that it's sounds better. It's a pink lemonade flavored vodka. That sounds good to me. It's actually not terrible. I tried a little sip of it. I'm not a huge vodka person, but it wasn't me bad. Me either. I, I'd I mean, I, I hardly drink alcohol. alcohol in general, but <laughs> like vodka I said, this is the first good. time I've heard of you drinking in like 10 years maybe yeah <laughs> pretty much dude it's pretty rare i just uh she got a, that little taster of it the little the little nip of it um so i decided to try it didn't really care for that specific whiskey so mixed it with uh root beer and was like holy shit that's good so i bought more <laughs> different whiskey whiskey i actually <laughs> like but now i'm downing five bottles of whiskey a day a day it's an expensive habit <laughs> like <laughs> It's $35 a bottle. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> but, <laughs> oh, yeah, we do have a tiny a nip of uh, spiced apple rum if you want that. But neither um, one of us yeah, want to drink see, that Yeah, see, here's one. the thing. When Dad almost killed me on my 21st birthday with uh, <laughs> Captain Morgan rum? and yeah, vodka. Yeah, yeah. I, That's, this is Captain like, Morgan. Captain Morgan apple. Yeah, it's it was original Captain Morgan. So, like, it's just the, like, that coconutty kind of i don't even know that's just <laughs> i think i would like I rum can't. to be honest because rum is just like a spice rum, maybe. whiskey basically <laughs> yeah so like i think it i just... would like it but i've i've never had it and i don't drink apple flavored stuff so i didn't even try the the rum that she got but yeah, yeah I, I think, think I, I just need it. to s steer away from the really cheap because, like, I like beer, but I can't do cheap, like, light beers, like Bud Light, Coors Light. I can't See, do that sort of I'm shit. I'm not a big beer drinker. The only beer I ever enjoyed was Yingling. Um, and then when I was younger, I would happily drink uh, Natty Light. <laughs> Which, I know. You're nasty, bro. I know. But, look, I was young, it was cheap, and to <laughs> me it didn't taste that bad. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it, dude. I'll have some Natty Light, whatever. Yeah, I like I like a lot of darker beers like uh, yeah like, like I like, uh, like the black Yingling I forget the name of it and they also have yeah. black and tan Yingling that was that was pretty decent. Um, I'm a but... I'm a Guinness man. I like Guinness. I like IPAs too, but I really like grapefruit and IPAs just taste taste like grapefruit without any sugar on them. Never um, had a proper uh, whatever you just said, but IPA. IPA. Yeah, they <laughs> literally just taste like grapefruit. If you go to uh, big bird i don't know if non people uh, from around here will know where that's at uh oh yeah okay i got you I didn't, well it's regional so i don't want i don't know anyways um you can mix a six pack of beer like different no, like, just local like whatever breweries flavors you want. and shit that's yeah cool. for 10 bucks you can get like a six pack uh you just pick yeah which kinds you want so that's how i've taste tested a lot of different beers um oh no not there okay not yet. I uh, that's actually where I bought my shit from today. What do I want to do? Um Ooh. 
Why do they want me to do this? No. Okay. Um. Okay, turn. I'm just skipping turn over and over again. <laughs> so, uh. To... Um, I guess maybe you. Where's Choke? Wow, all the way over there. How oh, many fucking funny. envoys have you sent to Valletta? Because I just many. popped about four of them back in there. And you're still the Suzer, and we're not even tied. Hold on, I'll be right back. My robot vacuum opened my door. Okay. <laughs> well, since we have the new cat, and she's bad, we had to start, uh locking our doors but we've only been like half locking them so you can open them from the inside or outside by just uh, like tapping the door a couple times so the robot vacuum just like ran into the door and was enough to to open it up did you end up liking the hard coffees i gave you forever ago noodle asked uh they weren't bad they had a weird tinge to them like a little weird aftertaste though um, like a slightly alcoholy aftertaste. Um, I don't know if I like. I yeah. <laughs> Coffee's such a morning thing for me. Like when I first wake up, so like the last thing I would want to do is drink an alcoholic beverage when I first wake up. But dr <laughs> drinking coffee like late at night just feels weird. So that's not what you do weird. first thing in the morning. Down yourself. <laughs> I used to drink a bunch of Irish coffee. Um, yeah, I mean, pour some whiskey in your coffee in the morning. It might help me get like, through work some days. Yeah. So. <laughs> Noodle said she hated the aftertaste too. Yeah, it just had a weird tinge. Noodle does drink coffee all day long. She said she has a bit of a uh, coffee problem. This is too true. It's also 2.11. So we got like 15 minutes left. Didn't realize how late it was it's getting. It's fine. I'm about to win anyways. Nice, dude. <laughs> Five more turns. The beginning of the end begins again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do I want to do here? Okay, hold on. Did I not just fucking... <sighs> Where is this? Okay. Holy shit. I'm making a lot of money. I'm making a lot of money, and I'm giving Pedro, like, 100 gold per turn. Are you for real? Why are you giving him so much damn gold, dude? Because I was, uh, I had, like, four deals going on back to back to back, uh, with oh, oil shit. and coal. Jesus. So, yeah. And then I'm still giving you ten gold per turn as well. Oh, uh, yeah, for oil. <laughs> yeah. Well, listen, I got the unlucky draw of not having oil within my territory. I have the unlucky draw of not having any power uh, producing resource within my territory. That's a lie. I have coal, I think. That no, actually I have oil. Sucks, I have oil. I have one thing of you... oil. Oh, because, okay. I say, why don't you just use that then? It. But I forgot, yeah, you're using it all for your units and shit. 
So is aluminum? I do it, like I have aluminum, but it appears it's only used for aircraft. For like modern yeah, and aircraft. I think I'm well, not positive, but isn't it well. only really used for building, not maintaining? I think is so. Is it used for maintaining? Oh no, I guess it is used for maintaining because I am it consuming is? it. That's yeah. stupid because uh, you only get two per resource, whereas with the other ones, don't you get three? Like oil and whatnot, you get three per. I think it just depends what improvements you have on the thing. Because, like, I only have one oil, but I'm getting three per turn, whereas, like, my aluminum... Oh, wait, accumulating four per turn. How? But it said I would only get two per turn when I built the... Certain technologies oh. increase it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually don't know what I want to do. With you me. probably get two per turn without even... Without even having a mine on it, and then the mine itself adds two extra per turn. Oh, maybe. Is that how maybe. that would work? I'm not positive, to be honest with you. Uh, so I don't really need you, like, in there anymore. Just come chill, like, over here. All right, all the skips. Next turn. Storm Peter's out. Hell yeah. Nobody wants to give me money for anything I'm willing to give them, and it's annoying. Like, I don't know if they just don't have enough money to give, but like, Monza doesn't want to give me money for anything either, which is surprising. Because I know he has money to give, and he's declaring friendship with me and shit. So, like... What's the max amount of civs you can have per per, or per game? 16? I don't know, actually. We should do a max civ and max city-state run. I, I know it'll go slow as shit, but <laughs> the chaos, oof. He Didn't must we do that in Civ 5 energies. before? Oh, I'm sure we did. We did just about everything there is to do in Civ 5. Giant dong, what's going wrong with you? Gung Zhao has been, like, nearing revolt for a very long time. Or does yeah. the giant fist mean that they are revolting? No, it means they're going in revolt. Going he would lose to, yeah. uh, control of it if they were actually revolting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. So what's all those guy. solar panels? Is that how you're powering that city? Yeah, but I'm not the one that built that. China. Did oh, all that. yeah, you stole that from China. Yeah. I guess that'd be my, like, I know Go you're nearing to. victory, but, like, yeah, maybe for next. Well, I guess you're not. You, you're only one. Step I say I'm actually. But... Yeah, it's actually still have some time. And uh, with the way the layout is for the actual winning, you have to get basically every technology. Um, yeah, I for science I saw that. Yeah, yeah, it's a pain in the ass. We got, I don't remember how it is by default, but we got a little fucked with uh, <laughs> the randomness. Yeah, because um, whenever I hit my golden age, it pretty much showed, like I got Eureka's for a lot pretty of much shit. all of the science yeah. uh, technologies I needed, and yeah, I looked and I was like, oh god. Okay, game's waiting on me. Next turn. Hmm. Wish Monza wasn't such a bitch. I thought you guys were friends, you said. We get along just fine, but, like, give me money. <laughs> oh, interesting. Oh, I got coastal flooding. Oof. Yay. Level two I'm trying flooding. to build my barriers, but I was closer, and... Now it's going to take longer, I think, because I just had improvements get fucked up. Pedro, what do you want? Yes, we're amazing, sure. Did you just wanted to tell me that? Okay. <laughs> what a waste of time. 
Uh, oh, we're in stage three and quickly going towards stage four. Yikes. The single biggest uh. in community. That's no good. Um, that's no good at all. That's why I'm doing carbon recapturing, but I can only do so much of it. What did you finish? Oh. The fuck did you just finish? I thought it would normally tell me what just got finished. Oh, well... That's no good. Shit got broken down because... Oh, the volcano exploded at some point. Uh. Oh, no. I was working on a campus research grant, but my campus just got permanently destroyed. Oh, that does suck, bro. Can I rebuild? Can you... Oh, once it's... What? Flooded, I don't you can't think you can rebuild take it, back. it. I don't think. There oh may be a way. God, I just don't so know. That's so stupid. But... Wait, sure what if I put a? Gone, it's gone. If you put a builder on it, can you destroy it permanently? I don't know how that works. I have a lot of money. I'm temp I'm gonna buy a builder and just check. In the meantime, build some flood barriers. I guess. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Um, holy shit, that's not good. Next time we play, I'm not... Maybe it's not as viable anymore to build coastal cities like that. Especially now <laughs> you can build a harbor and whatnot. That's true, yeah. It just sucks because you don't get access to the sea until later, whenever you do that. But I mean... Yeah, I think I'm going to not have literally all of my cities on coastline, though. I mean, fair. And I might, I might be smarter about where I place my... Or just make sure you build flood barriers early. I didn't realize how quickly the CO2 was going to Well, once everyone starts using coal and shit. Yeah, but you and I were quite ahead, and now it seems everyone's That's starting true. to jump in on it. I mean, we have um, played another, like, 50 turns tonight or something, so it's not like it was really that quick. Am I missing a texture? Is it like bright purple or something? It's like a no, it's a bright red exclamation mark is sitting over here though. I have no idea where at. That's um to the left of Willy Wonka. The, <laughs> <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> here, I'll I'll just take to a the screenshot. Left of Willy Wonka. Yeah, I don't have it. Uh, I mean I see Willy Wonka, but I don't have a bright red exclamation mark, so it's not, like, it's not bright, bright red, but, like, oh, maybe I should crop this so you can't see my, all my shit going on. Fuck that. You don't want me to see your secrets, my guy? I'm not. I think that's a missing texture. Not willing to trade coal. What? Okay, then. Did you upload it? Yeah, it's on the general marker hangout. Oh, it's like a 3D fucking yeah. exclamation mark, too. That's weird. Yeah. I don't know what that is. I'm guessing like it's a, it like a missing texture for a unit, then, or something. If it's, since it's But 3D. I don't have a unit over there. Maybe somebody else does. Oh, yeah, maybe. Oh, shit. I wasn't ready. Fuck. I forgot. I was going to buy a, uh, a worker. See if I could redo my science. Shit. Orders. Oh, look at that fighter jet. You like him? Just chilling over there. 
I thought it was pretty cool. That warmongering nation across the border there. You literally have more units than me over there. How many giant death robots do you have sitting in the fog of war? Only six. I no, I would be okay. super broke if I had fucking <laughs> six, dude. <laughs> like, How much do they cost to maintain, I wonder? Uh, I'm not positive, but it, it's got to be enough. <laughs> uh, I kind of want to go to war with Gilgamesh. He's why like, Gilgamesh? I don't know. He's just up here by Belogna. He got Shanghai and Kish. <laughs> I feel like Kish. he probably got some, got some, uh, some good Kush. I mean, he got oil real deep in there. <laughs> oh, never mind. Kish oh, and Shanghai fuck. only have five oh, population. That's Skip not turn. even, it's not even worth it. Skip turn. Uh, skip. Next turn's a big one. Your next turn's a big one? Yeah, it's the beginning of the end again. I feel like you keep saying that, yeah. <laughs> How many beginnings to the end can you have, dude? Oh, every end is another beginning. Uh, again. yeah. That's true, I guess. What's that song? Oh, we got five minutes. Shit in there. I it's have no fine. idea it's what the I fuck need. you're talking about. <laughs> Closing time. That song. Oh, does it say that in it? Yeah. Every All I can remember from that beginning. song is just closing time repeated. <laughs> closing, <60 yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> so. uh, Semisonic, yeah. Every new beginning comes from some other beginning's end. That's the closing lyrics on closing time. Nice. Give me that fucking e-commerce there. Amazon. Uh, <laughs> Give me that fucking e-commerce Amazon. <laughs> what the fuck? I said like Amazon. <laughs> um. Ah, uh, shit. I need... I need the good shit. <laughs> I need the good shit. Yes. Yes. <laughs> the fuck <laughs> you got going on over there? <laughs> a lot of a lot of shit's going down. Get that shit the fuck out of here though. Put you up there. And then give me back my great people. Really? No, that's not worth it. Give me oh. it. Artist. What? No. What? You good, homie? Are they not called great scientists no more? Yes. No, they are. Mention. Wait, what are you looking for? I didn't hear what you said. The great scientists. Um, oh, they're all gone. They've all been claimed. Government policy. Oh, well, there's no point. They're all gone. Oh, that would make sense. So. Well, over to this, I suppose. Confirm. I mean, I guess I shouldn't have told you that. Technically, that's helping you, but yeah, no, it's it's pointless. It's fine, I suppose. Um, I need whatever shit's gonna give me. Whoa, that's no wild. Would have believed in the last year. I'm going to get. I'm also going to get synthetic not technocracy uh before i literally get any of the I know. three other it's, a, it's like the last one <laughs> and you get it way before everything else although i can get communism quickly should i just become a... no i can't yeah. that's against i can't roll by that 
100%. I don't understand how culture victory works. I have uh, it's confusing. I don't so much more here. tourism. I have three times more tourism than anyone else. I have double everyone else combined. And I have a about as much culture as the entire rest of the world combined. And yet yeah, I, I only know. have like one third of the way to a culture victory. I do not understand how culture victory works. Like, um, I just don't fucking get it. It just blows my mind, dude. I'm so lost as far as that shit goes. Yeah, I don't... You really gotta invest heavily, I guess, in culture. I don't know. Honestly. Oh, shit. This was my big turn to do shit. Um, oh, yeah, that was the last turn. The oh, last the turn? Last. Yeah. It's the last uh, turn. One more. Just one more. It's 2.30. I gotta get out. I gotta get a shower and Just shit. Just one more. I literally can't play one more. I gotta get to bed. Wow. It's gonna leave me like this. Oh, did We're I tell playing you? Again I, in two weeks. Persona Five has been wild. That's what I'm going to play after this. I've been wanting to I've play been, it, but China no I've longer been, has enough loyalty. So if you want a Chinese city, now this time, it's up for grabs for free. Are you going to take it? Um, probably not. I'm trying to look at it, but it won't let me. Uh, I might take it and liberate it. I am tempted to do that. Nah. I think we're just gonna let them deal with their own shit. Honestly. I have a big project happening now. Wait, did you click next turn? Yes. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did we never actually... How did you finish your turn so quick when it's been taking you a year to do anything? Because <laughs> the path ahead is clear as day. <laughs> I'm seriously curious. Like, what victory are you going for now? Um, I'm not... I can't disclose that information. What victory did you plan Classified. on going for originally, then? Can you say that? Uh, it's the victory I'm still potentially going for. Okay. My so domination. So I, it's I classified. Guess. It's not domination. Why do you think that? <laughs> uh, maybe I built up my military to deter you from building up the rest of your areas, even slightly, so you would mass produce military to counter mine. It's all head games. That's a smart play, except I was ahead of you in military the entire time, so I never needed to do that. Nuh-uh. There was times I was above you. Yeah, by like ten points. <laughs> like it wasn't enough for me. No, to when I went to war produce. with China, I think I could have potentially beat you. Just in, you in a being war here, well. honestly, is why I have such a big military. Because I know in the past you've always been a warmonger. I just have scars from ten <laughs> from years me killing ago you to every the day time <laughs> that we when I, I I didn't have my military large. And in the fog of war, you had three million units on standby. This guy's talking about the time he nuked me and then was surprised whenever I decided to I kill him. I did not him. nuke you. Um, and the reason he nuked me, because I, I brought was... nuclear energy to your country. <laughs> he peacefully. nuked me because I was getting close to a, a, a science victory. What else was I supposed to so... <laughs> do? Just sit there and watch you win? You use policies and try to outrace me or... I did use policies. Get quicker... <laughs> or get quick my on advisor your own win, dude. my advisors told me to nuke you mm. so my the democratic advisors, thing to do because um, i'm not a commie my democratic thing to do <laughs> is to listen to the people <laughs> i don't think the democratic thing to do is to blow someone else up <laughs> if all the people say hey like, we want that that's the democratic thing to do this guy you go with this it. guy all right that was legit the last i have representatives time. in my country unlike you I have a more advanced form of government than you do. What are you talking about? I'm about to also be a technical. Well, you don't even know what type of government, a technocratic, whatever shit. 
a synthetic techno te technocracy. <laughs> Are you well, a technocracy, it from? <laughs> no, a technocracy would be a government led by a technology. Um, so synthetic technocracy. So you pretty, I don't know what the synthetic part means, but like. So what you're telling me is you yeah, essentially have like Elon Musk synthetic. running your country right yeah, now. Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds fucking terrible. <laughs> Which is. Yeah. <laughs> uh. uh I'm, like I won't play the next turn. Well, I'm going to kind of play the next turn. I what just want to see what he offers me. Technocracy. He wants me That's to give him game. aluminum for open borders. Oh. Yeah, it's a government Long ran time. as a technical or engineering problem. Um, but what is a synthetic one? I don't know. Every resource just points Robots. to Civ. <laughs> so, <laughs> so according to to the Civ wiki. Technogra tech yeah, that word is government by experts in the technical details of specific issues who presumably best understand both the problems at hand and how various technological uh, redresses can improve the society at large. So a synthetic technocracy is one where the experts in governance could include non-human agents. Okay. Okay. Oh, so like in Mass Effect, uh, in Mass Effect Andromeda, without giving yeah. spoilers... Uh, you leave the Milky Way, and this initiative initiative leads the like forms a new government essentially and leads the expedition to the next galaxy. So, because they're leading through a goal of you know science and whatnot, would that be technically? I guess kind of because they're yeah. leading through a like yeah. an objective, and, and they some... also have AI leading them. So yeah, so they not they leading would them directly, but like helping a... them. Yeah. So they would probably technically be a synthetic technocracy or whatever the fuck that word is. I guess. Interesting. Uh. What's your days off that you don't stream? That I don't stream? Monday. Yeah. Hence why I'm trying to get you to come over on Mondays. Um, How about we play this on Monday? <laughs> um... And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> but there is another day I don't stream. I just can't remember what the fuck it is. <laughs> Are you turning 30 this year? Yeah, bro. Oh, my God. Yeah, boy. I was going to call you old, but you are old. <laughs> uh... I'm the last sibling holding out. You're <laughs> the last sibling. <laughs> Just the point blank. The Just 20, the last fucking sibling, dude. How's it feel being the last sibling ancient. of the world? Um, I don't know. A lot of, <laughs> a lot of my shoulders here. Um, All that youth. <laughs> All that youth. Jesus Christ. I'm almost halfway through my 20s. Anyways, <sighs> I think it's time to, to get off. Next turn. No, to get off. Uh, maybe don't do that on Twitch. I might get you. A <laughs> yeah. What? Perma band. You're not allowed to get off on Twitch. No. I'm well. Sure I think there's been there. a couple streamers who have, and yeah. they only got like a week ban. I feel day. like I don't know the rules, but I feel like you can probably get off. You just can't show anything, and you probably can't make it painfully obvious that you are getting off. Um, I'm guessing, but. I think I don't there know is the a girl rules there, who, and I'm rather like I wouldn't try to push it. <laughs> yeah, I think there was a girl streamer who got off on stream under the, her desk and didn't show it directly, but she still got banned. But it was like a slap on the wrist. I think she was reinstated after a week. Yeah, see, that's not even really I a ban at that point. That's a vacation. If you're a big yeah, that's streamer. what they call it. Yeah. <laughs> like... <laughs> Anyways, though, no, that that legitimately is it. Thank you guys for coming and hanging out. It's a good if way there's to anybody, end the if there's anybody still awake out there, we appreciate you coming and hanging out with us while we play Civ. It's the only way we actually get a play Civ. So thank you for that. Uh, tomorrow Saturday, so I won't be streaming tomorrow. Uh, Ooh, that's the other Saturday day. Sure. Sure. Yeah, yeah, that's the other day. But I play uh, D and D Saturday nights. Oh yeah, yeah. It's Saturday and Wednesday night. Monday nights the only night I actually have anything 
time free. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, I won't be streaming tomorrow, but I'll be back Sunday with some PlayStation 2 something or another. So I hope to see you guys there. Until then, though, guys, have a wonderful night. And as always, be kind to each other. Bye-bye, y'all. Bye. He said it. He said goodbye this time. Oh, my God. So proud of you. Thanks. Have I ever told you guys that I absolutely love Noodle? Just like more than anything in the world. Just want you all to know. You left the Ed off on purpose. It was from Foster's house. Oh. Lame. <laughs> okay. I got I got 50 Noodle. Did you make your way off the farm? Oh, okay. Well. How, how am I supposed to make a chest if you're just going to leave me like that? Oh, my lord. I don't remember telling you to get off the farm. You're literally making stuff up. She has a bad habit of lying about everything all the time. Just so everyone knows. You always remember when Ed from Ed, Ed and Eddie would <laughs> shout buttered toast? Yes. Drop your, drop your wood. Drop it, drop it low, girl. Did you drop it? <laughs> Just like any other controller? There we go. Thank you. Yeah, go ahead. Go find whatever you need to find. Uh, one of the best things for for food is um the salad at the bar. For the price, it's one of the best things that you can get. Okay. No, I mean you don't have to buy a salad if you don't want to noodle, but I'm I'm just saying it's one of the best ones. Check and see if you can, because one of the flowers gives you energy. She asks if she could eat a daffodil.